this year's Foil Ambassador project started when a group of 24 young people from different communities came together to discover the foil through a range of activities. The purpose of this programme was to get young people connected with the River Foil, its tributaries and estuary, its wildlife and the recreational opportunities it holds. During the programme, the ambassadors learned how to fish using a range of techniques and under the instruction of qualified angling coaches, gained their CAST Level 1 and CAST Level 2 awards in angling. The ambassadors were shown how to cast a line, hook on bait, land a fish and unhook a fish and the concepts of catch and release. The ambassadors also learned the art of fly tying and about why there are different colours, shapes and sizes of fly depending on the time of year and what you are fishing for. Once they had caught a fish, the ambassadors wanted to know how they would cook it. The group had a cooking demonstration from a local chef where they learned how to prepare and cook trout in different ways and tried something they hadn't tasted before. <laughs> From freshwater fish to sea fish, the group battled the cold in December to try a spot of sea fishing from kayaks and from the beach. The ambassadors enjoyed learning about the different methods and how to adapt their techniques and equipment to the marine environment.
<laughs> After the sea fishing and in from the cold, the ambassadors cozied up with a cup of chowder and reflected on the fun they had learning all the different fishing techniques. <laughs> they were taught how to prepare seafood and cook their catch from the beach fishing by the no salt chef. Get this message going. Wow, my brain's uh, muscles. They tried different types of seafood, including mussels, which many had never even tried before. Now a few things I'll tell you about it in a few minutes, just very lightly into it. And then, yeah, so they've opened up, look. And you go in and you can get some of the juice, remove that shell and use that as your... Mm -hmm. Even within just a trangy to get a few muscles together. Along the foil, there are several protected areas due to the important wildlife that these areas support, such as wading birds. The ambassadors carried out a beach clean on a stretch of coastline with such a designation, lifting two jeep loads of domestic and commercial rubbish off a two kilometre stretch of coastline. This clean-up activity gave the ambassadors lots to think about and discuss as part of the conserve element of their John Muir Award. Foil Ambassadors completed lots of other activities over the course of the 10 week programme as part of working towards their John Muir Award where they discover, explore, conserve and share a wild place including building and installing bat and bird boxes, sharing their experiences through written pieces and artwork, discovering and exploring new species and habitats. The new ambassadors and our returning ambassadors had amazing experiences throughout the programme and not only discovered, explored and learned about new places, landscapes and wildlife together by land, river and sea, but also worked together as part of a team in order to conserve and protect habitats and share their experiences with others. Let's hear what they had to say about the experience. I've really enjoyed this programme and I think it's been a great opportunity to do things that I might not have otherwise been able to do, such as powerboating and I even got a qualification out of it. My favourite thing about the Foil Ambassadors was going on the residential, doing exciting challenges I probably would have never done before. I really enjoyed the programme and I'm really proud of myself that I got in their boat because I never thought I'd get in their boat because I'm scared of them. I've enjoyed my experience in the programme because I overcome my fear of heights and got to defence and I thought I'd be able to. I've overcome my fear of like, talking in groups and in front of other people. The thing I enjoyed most about the Foil Ambassador programme was being able to do new experiences such as canoeing down the foil. I also learned crucial life skills like learn how to deal with stress. Being a Foil Ambassador has helped and motivated me to pursue a future career in marine biology. I've enjoyed every moment of the programme, especially the feeling of achievement uh, of seeing a beach after a successful litter pick. I came back to the Foreign Ambassadors this year because I really enjoyed it last year and I wanted to take on more responsibility. This year with a new Foreign Ambassadors coming through, uh, I particularly excel in the fishing and I have caught my level one assistant coaching award. I'm really glad I've came back as a mentor this year and I've enjoyed seeing the new ambassadors take on the role of the foil ambassador. I've really enjoyed the personal development sessions this year and I feel like it'll help me with life skills to take the university. I'm really glad I came back to the foil ambassadors. Uh, as a return ambassador I feel as a, more as a leader towards the new ambassadors. Uh, I'm proud to get my level 2 power voting licence. and. Uh, it's something that I've always hoped for the rest of my life and a good qualification to have. 
I really enjoyed the laxatives in CES year because uh, I got to do stuff that I wouldn't do like uh, powerboating, fishing and surfing. I'm proud to be a foil ambassador. Mentoring the new foil ambassadors has shown me how far I've come and it's allowed me to develop great leadership qualities and as a result I'm a more confident person. I enjoyed doing the powerboating because I, I never thought I'd seen the city from such a different perspective than everyone else. Powerboating was a firm favourite with the ambassadors and the group gained their Powerboat Level 1 qualification with some of the returning ambassadors gaining their Level 2 qualifications also. Seeing the river from a different perspective is what this programme was all about and all of the ambassadors now have an increased understanding of the river foil and a confidence to work with and inform the public about its wonderful resources and opportunities.